Hey there guys, Argon Matrix from the past here, interrupting your regular session of Super Mario RPG to bring you something really quick that I missed in the last episode. So we're back here in Balome Temple, um, right before the elevator that you go down to Balome at, and in this room right here I actually missed two different hidden treasure chests, one of which is right up here, and it's a frog coin, and the other one right here, and it's another frog coin. So those are two very useful hidden chests to find, and I am sorry for missing them. So now back to your regular scheduled Super Mario RPG. Here we go. Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here welcoming you to episode 38 of Super Mario RPG. Last time we made it all the way to Monster Tra Town through Balom Temple and such. And then we had a nice little run with the three musty fears in there. Oh we also had post commentary, which was no fun, boo. But now that we're here, let's just go ahead and start exploring Monster, Tra Monster Town. Nice little welcome sign there. Okay, so in this first room, there's some strange fan. Breeze, gust, or blast. Hmm. You know what? I like full force. Oh my god. Holy crap. That's scary. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Uh, Monster Mama. Oh my, a traveler from afar. Welcome to Monster Town, where many of our kind mingle. I'm the landlady, Monster Mama. Ooh. Oh, what the? <laughs> a star, you say? Oh, you're here, you're here to see our star? She's upstairs, so feel free to go and take a look for yourself. Alright, sweet, that's gonna be an easy star piece. Let's do it. Wait, you're not a star. Who are you? I've been all around the world, but the strangest person I met is this old geezer in Rose Town. It's really weird, but definitely worth meeting. Good to know. Sometimes if you jump at the right places, a treasure box will pop out of thin air. Any anything like this happen to you? No, only since like the first three episodes. These treasure boxes are known as surprise boxes because they appear out of nowhere. You think you found them all, but there's still 14 left. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know there was a counter. Sweet. I'm pretty sure that's another thing for the Melody Bay. That song that we just heard right there, I think that's the last song that you need to play to get like the last card. And why can't I jump jump over the flowers? I'm clearly jumping high enough, but ah oh, damn it. Yeah. Uh, so I'll come back later because I don't know the exact notes right now, and I'll, I'll just show that later, I guess, because I'm too lazy to look it up right now. So what do you think? Isn't our star adorable? I suppose, but I'm looking for another kind of star. So yeah, no. Ex See the peace star exactly. Star bees. Oh, Star Peace. <laughs> yeah, Star Peace. No, I'm not familiar with them. So you came all the way out here to search for a Star Peace? It must be really important. This is the last place on land. If you can't find it here, the only place left is up. What? So do you mean we have to go to heaven? So, you want to go there? Ha, you're an open book. Okay, here's what you need to do. There's a secret passage to the sky at Bean Valley. But first, you must scale the cliff beyond the desert to get there across the sea and over the hill, the grandmother's house we go. Since this is your, you're such a nice guy, I'll introduce you to someone that can help you. Sky Troopers, I need you! What? Sky Troopers? Um, are they coming? They, wow, that took, that was delayed. What was our flying time, troops? 8.52 seconds, Sergeant! Okay. Very official. Sky Troopers, reporting for duty, ma'am! We're 0.52 seconds late. Hold myself personally accountable for the delay, man. Still as rigid as ever about your rules and regulations. No need to bother with the protocol around me, Sergeant. I've got to ask a favor. I've got a favor to ask of you. Yes, ma'am. Anything we can do for a civilian. This fellow here really wants to get to Bean Valley. Could you help him scale the cliff? Understood, ma'am. The orders are: get mustache over the cliff. <laughs> we will succeed. That's a ridiculous sentence. We will now deploy ourselves to the cliff at land's end. Troopers, keep tight formation. And... We have a lift off! Boom. They're odd, but trustworthy. Good luck with your search. So they're waiting for us somewhere in land's end now, apparently. And that's gonna take us to the next area of the game, but we still have an entire town here to explore, so why rush? Alright, here's a nice little place. So the super jump is your specialty, right? Oh, you know it. Those multiple jumps of yours are pretty amazing. I heard that if you record consecutive jumps, it stands, stands at 13. Thir really? That's it? That's crap. How do you do it? 
jump more than 30 times in a row and I'll give you a prize. Yeah, so this guy, he is kind of useful. If if you feel like taking the challenge you, and jump 30 times in a row, he will give you uh, something. I, I'll probably show that off. Hold on, maybe if I can... No, I'm not going to look right now, but he'll give you something. And he'll give you another reward, which I believe is the super suit, the best armor in the game, if you manage to jump 100 times in a row with the super jump, which is no easy thing. So, I I don't even know if I can pull it off, but yeah. Quite, quite an accomplished jumper. Yep. Alright, and the piranha plant here. It's really weird. Sometimes I hear that guy next door. He's always mumbling about that crystal this and evil that. Isn't the crystal some kind of shiny rock or something? I know of, I know I've seen those somewhere. Hmm. I don't know. There's lots of crystals in Final Fantasy games and stuff. Maybe that guy's a Final Fantasy fanatic. I don't know. It's been sealed. Okay. Look! The shiny stone is reacting. The seal has been broken. Hmm. Well, let's see what this guy has to do about crystals. Let's see. Um. I think I broke the game. What the? Who are you? Greetings. I am Culex, Dark Knight of Vanda. I have crossed into this dimension to fight for the Dark Mage. But this world is uninhabitable. So for me and my kind, I must return to my own world. Before I go, though, I would like to challenge your strongest knight. Will you accept my challenge? Will you enter combat against me? Hell, what have we got to lose? <laughs> On guard. Alright, well that was embarrassing. Let's not show any of that and just move on here. Okay, so welcome to the weapon and armor shop. Yeah, just a minute. I'll be there in a second. Come on, I need to be served now. Oh my. Bowser, what are you doing? Goomba, what are you doing here? Bowser, it's been ages, hasn't it? Sorry about going AWOL on you. I ran away because I was scared to fight Smithy. A lot has happened since then, but I look how far I've come. I'm managing the store now. A Goomba managing a store. How ridiculous. Hi, Uncle Bowser. Aww. Three little Goombets. How cute. Although I can't fight you. Fight for you. I still have some items you can use. Maybe you can find it in your heart. I forgive me if, if I can help you get equipped. Dot, 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 dot. Don't worry. I'm not angry with you. I've got new troops now, and we're going to reclaim my castle. You go on with your life here. I wish you the best. Now oh, that's nice, Bowser. How very uncharacteristic of you. We want to help, too. Please, please, can we? All right, so all these guys sell mushrooms. Nothing useful. But these ones are different. You can see, recovers 30... Wait, does that say recovers? It says recovers. Wow. I located a typo in the game. Great. So it recovers 30 HP, but... Dot, dot, dot. Yeah. That basically signifies that when you use it, it actually turns you into a mushroom. It, it's, it does recover 30 HP, don't get me wrong. But it, it also turns you into a mushroom, which can be useful too, because it's like auto-recovery every turn. You just can't do anything. Okay. Um, so what does this guy have to sell, though? Let's see. What can I get you? Okay, so basically he has some little a few supplies here. Um, let's see, made mushrooms, maple, I'm probably gonna buy some maple, oh crap, don't need any of those, um, okay, I need some room here to buy some of this stuff, can I sell anything? Okay, oh, I can, I can, should probably sell a few of those pick-me-ups, get rid of the pure water, uh, the rest of this I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna sell some of them, my pick-me-ups though, I don't need this many now that, especially now that I have the, uh, come back from peach okay so let's buy some more of these mid mushrooms uh, some maple syrups and yeah I can't buy any more of the maple syrups okay well uh, let me see are any of these good for Bowser hold on I'm gonna just check my equipment right now see how I stand and I'll let you know okay so I checked and um the spiked link is better than Bowser's current Hurley loves, but I'm only buying this just for like the pretty much completion sake of it, because I'm probably never going to use Bowser. And Curd Shell is still worse than his work pants, in my opinion. Okay, so I guess we'll equip that why not right now. I don't see why not. Yeah, there you go. And let's get out of here. This shop doesn't serve much of a purpose, really, honestly. Oh, we've already been to the Three Musty Fears. Um, in here, I'm going to show this off really quick before I forget. There's a hidden block there. It contains frog coin. Don't forget that now. Alright. 
Ah, uh, can I get like over there? I want to get the key. I want to get the key. Oh well. All right, uh, I should probably save because after getting the game over against Qlex, I don't think it's. I think it's a bit. I think it's a pretty good idea to save. Okay, perfect. And now let's work our way up here to the last house, which is. Can I read? Can I read the sign? Apparently not. Okay. Well, here we have. Who is it? Sorry, but Santa isn't in. Oh well. Oh my gosh. Jagger? Wow, he actually remembers all of his subjects by name. That's cool. Bowser, I haven't seen you in so long. I've been studying here at the dojo under Sensei Jinx because, to tell you the truth, I knew I couldn't beat Smithy. That's why I'm here now. Someday I'm going to return and make you proud. More dots from Bowser. Don't worry about me. I've got new troopers now, and we're going to take back my castle. You stick with your guns. Train like there's no tomorrow. Jeez, Bowser's so freaking encouraging. My sensei is out right now, I'll, but he'll be back shortly. In the meantime, will you accept the challenge from me? Eh, sure, why not? Got nothing to lose. Uh, I don't think this guy's quite as hard as Q-Lex, so we shouldn't get another game over. Alright, so here we have Jagger. I'm not even going to look up his weaknesses, because I'm sure he's weak. Uh, oh, that's actually a pretty good punch. Yeah, pack a hefty punch there, Jagger. Alright, let's go for 30. Oh, that was only 12. That sucked. Terra Punch. Holy balls. That's one powerful punch, Jagger. I've underestimated you, it seems. No, don't punch. No, hasn't it? It's not nice to punch a girl, dude. Jeez. Okay, Terra. Oh my god. He's gonna kill Peach. No. You jackass. Oh crap. Well. Fuck. He's just like tearing us apart. Um. Damn it. You know what? Let's use earlier times. Screw this. Screw you, Jagger. Okay, so now we've gone back in time. See, that can be pretty useful. If you get screwed over like that or underestimate something, then it's actually a very useful thing to have. Okay, well, he has no weaknesses, 600 hit points, and he is immune to jump, or resistant to jump, rather, fire and poison. Okay, well, let's just go ahead and, Gino. You know, Gino blast his ass. Here we go. Yeah. Take that. And die, 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 die. Die to the power of disco. And oh my god. That, uh, that terror punch again. Well, at least you missed. Damn, he's fast too. Alright. Mario doesn't really have anything that he's not resistant to. And Peach. Actually, Peach, you can use the mystery egg. We should get to doing that. Yeah. Aw, oh, not quite. See, when you use that enough times, that egg is gonna hatch and you're gonna get something out of it. What is it? I don't know. Speculate. I have to- I'm not blocking that correctly. I need to get better. Better, faster, stronger. Okay, damn, this episode's taking forever. Uh, I could probably use the- Yikes, you're tough. Oh, I guess we beat him. Okay. Obviously, he doesn't die because that would be too brutal for a dojo. Yikes, I guess I underestimated something. Mario, you're a top-notch fighter. Indeed, you did well for an apprentice, Jagger. For your inexperience, I think it said. Sensei, have you been here all along? Hmm, you followed my key, did you? didn't you? Not bad for a novice. Where's, where is he? Oh, what the? That tiny thing? Holy balls. What? Whoa. Damn. Your fighting style, it isn't as foolproof as you think. What the? I'll accept a challenge any day. Um, okay. Well, we're not going to challenge him right now, because, number one, we're reaching the end of the episode here, and number two, I'm not up to snuff. So, uh, thank you everyone for watching, and until next time, this is Argon Matrix signing up. Thank you, and good night.